नमस्ते एवरी वन एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल सपना योगा डायरी इफ़ यू आर सफरिंग फ्राम ऑस्टियो अर्थराइटिस एंड हैव पेन अराउंड योर नी और हिप जॉइंट देन दिस इज द प्रैक्टिस फॉर यू डू दिस प्रैक्टिस एवरी डे फॉर अ मंथ एंड यू विल स्टार्ट फीलिंग द इफेक्ट ऑफ इट सो या विदाउट एनी डिले लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो so the kriyas that i am going to show you are going to practice the same kriya in the same order if you feel any kriya is difficult for you you are not comfortable doing it skip it and move to the next one okay so let's begin the practice we are going to begin the practice with om chanting okay if you are not comfortable sitting in the cross leg position you can extend your legs forward and sit like this also no problem so yeah Let's start with three rounds of Om chanting. Start with me now. Uh Slowly bring your palms together in Namaskar Mudra. Start rubbing. Feel the heat. Feel the energy. Now bring this energy to your eyes. Cover your eyelids and stay there for three, two, one. Slowly uncover and very gently open your eyes. Good. Every day when you are practicing, you are going to start in the same manner. If you do not know how to chant Om, I have a video you can go and watch and understand how you have to practice Om chanting. Starting your practice with the Om chanting is very important as it calms your mind and you are going to practice with the calmer mindset. Okay, so let's begin the practice. Extend your legs forward. If you are not comfortable sitting in the cross leg position, you can start from the very beginning, extending your legs forward. No problem. Okay, so we are going to start with the minor joint. You can see the toes. There are five toes here. There are five toes here. You will take your arms back. you will take your arms back take the support of the arm if you want you can also take the support at the back okay you can rest your back on the bed um, or uh, on the chair extending your legs forward somewhere on the table or on the bed okay so you can start this way what you have to do is uh, we are going to start with toes bending so you are going to bend your toes this way as you inhale you are going to stretch your toes backward towards your body as you exhale you are going to bend your toes inward okay inhale back to move your toes backward exhale bend your toes inward all right so yeah let's begin inhale move your toes backward exhale bend your toes inward inhale move your toes backward exhale bend your toes inward inhale move your toes backward exhale bend your toes inward inhale move your toes backward exhale bend your toes inward inhale move your toes backward exhale bend your toes inward inhale move your toes backward exhale bend your toes inward inhale move your toes backward 
exhale bend your toes inward good now second kriya second practice here you have to move your feet backward and forward from the ankle okay this is called ankle bending as the bending is happening from the ankle you're going to move your both feet together so as you inhale you will move your feet backward as you exhale you are going to bend your feet forward okay as much as is comfortable so resting your palm backward taking this the support of the palm inhale move your feet backward exhale bend your feet forward inhale move your feet backward exhale bend your feet forward inhale move your feet backward exhale bend your feet forward inhale move your feet backward exhale bend your feet forward inhale move your feet backward exhale bend your feet forward inhale move your feet backward exhale move your feet forward inhale move your feet backward exhale bend your feet forward one more time inhale move your feet backward exhale bend your feet forward very good okay now what you have to do is you have to rotate your feet from the ankle rotate in the circular manner okay so you keep your feet together and you're going to rotate in this manner don't go fast fast <laughs> you have to engage the breath with the movement okay so as you move your feet up you are going to inhale as you bring it down you are going to exhale move your legs slowly slower you go better it is okay so slow down your breath and move it slowly like this see <sighs> this is how you are going to move chalo start with me now keep moving inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down 5 inhale up exhale down 6 inhale up exhale down 7 inhale up exhale down 8 inhale up exhale down 9 inhale up exhale down 10 reverse now you have to do the same thing with the opposite direction up you have to move it in the opposite direction start now inhale up exhale down 1 inhale up exhale down 2 inhale up exhale down 3 inhale up exhale down 4 inhale up exhale down 5 inhale up exhale down 6 inhale up exhale down 7 inhale up exhale down 8 inhale up exhale down 9 inhale up exhale down 10 relax good now next practice now what you have to do is you have to maintain distance separate your legs now one will be moving clockwise other will be moving anti clockwise so you are going to move your leg in this manner see so you'll maintain distance so one clockwise one anti clockwise take it inside to outside like this inside to outside inside to outside okay inside to outside slowly inhale up exhale down inhale up exhale down 1 inhale up exhale down 2 inhale up exhale down 3 inhale up exhale down 4 inhale up exhale down 5 inhale up exhale down 6 inhale up exhale down 
inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten now that was inside to outside now you are going to move outside to inside like this outside to inside outside to inside inhale up exhale down inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten very good now next one in the next practice what you are going to do you can take break as and when you need if you feel tired just take a break and when you feel you are good to continue start again okay so one leg will be like this resting extend your leg uh, forward and the other one bend it from the knee now interlock your fingers like this interlock interlock your fingers under your thigh now as you inhale stretch your leg forward keep your knee straight back straight as you exhale bend your knee bring your thigh close to the chest okay so thigh close to the chest the leg will be held up don't bring your leg down if it is difficult to keep it up then only bring it down okay so inhale exhale 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 okay relax same thing on the other leg keep this relaxed bend it from the knee and start inhale exhale 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 relax extend your legs forward relax relax 3 relax 2 and relax 1 okay In the next practice what you have to do is you have to clench your fist clench your fist and now place this folded finger side under your knee okay folded finger side under your knee now once you place it there try to lift your legs up okay so lift your legs high keeping your back as straight as you can see how much you are able to lift 
see how much you are able to lift and for how long you are able to lift hold 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 keep breathing 3 2 1 and down okay so if suppose you are not able to do for 10 counts no problem if it is 5 it's okay tomorrow it is going to be 6 then 7 that's how you are going to improve if you are not able to lift your legs at all then what you do is you place your arms at the back take the support of the leg suppose you have to lift this leg place this heel under your knee and lift one leg up so one leg up at a time so see one leg up once hold it here for as long as is comfortable for one minute try to lift your leg up as high as you can okay and once you are done on this side do the same thing on the other side lift it up one side at a time one leg at a time hold once you are done release and relax okay now next practice for the next practice what you are going to do is you are going to extend your one leg forward again bend your other leg place it on your thigh as high as is comfortable if it is difficult for you you can skip this movement okay if this is comfortable only then do it what you have to do is you are holding your leg here so you are start start to rotate rotate from the ankle okay inhale up exhale down again start inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten now reverse the direction do it anti-clockwise inhale up exhale down ten inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down one release relax do the same thing on the other side on the other side start let me show you from this side okay start rotating inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten reverse inhale up exhale down ten inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down seven inhale up 
exhale down six inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down one okay relax now in the next practice what you have to do you have to bend your leg again and you have to rotate your leg in the circular motion from the lower half of the leg down from the knee okay so you are going to interlock your fingers under your thigh and rotate in this manner see this is how you are going to rotate try to keep your back as straight as you can and remember the thigh there should be minimum movement or no movement in the thigh the movement should happen down from the knee so you are going to rotate like this see keep this part part static lift your leg up and inhale up exhale down one inhale up i'll show you from the front inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten remember the circle doesn't have to be very big you can make a small circle you should be comfortable okay you can move even if this much you are moving it is okay it is okay all right so we are going to now reverse the direction anti clockwise okay we were rotating like this now we are going to rotate the other side start now inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten okay relax relax this leg and now we are going to switch to the other side remember if any movement you are not comfortable with you can skip that and move to the next one okay chalo start on the other side inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten reverse inhale up exhale down ten inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down one relax if you are not able to sit on the floor practice it sitting on the bed these are easy practices you will soon be able to sit on the floor as if you practice it on a regular basis okay 
next one now this is done now next one again you are going to extend your one leg forward and then you are going to one leg forward and fold your other leg okay this time what you are going to do hold your knee as you inhale uh, you, what you have to do is you have to rotate your knee here okay circular motion from the knee it could be this much or it could be this okay if you are not able to rotate your knee what you will do you will inhale up exhale down okay so first let's do the rotation inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up rotate little bit three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten okay you are rotating this way now you are going to reverse so inhale up from the back bring it front one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten okay done with rotation now we are going to move it up and down if you cannot do the rotation do only up and down inhale up exhale down Chalo. inhale up back straight exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten good relax now same thing on the other side Chalo. hold your foot from the front and get ready to rotate keep your back as straight as you can start now inhale up exhale down one inhale up from front to backward two inhale up exhale down three take it back inhale up exhale down four rotation inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten now reverse from backward bring it from forward inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten okay now we are going to move it up and down back straight start inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five 
inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten okay relax relax three two and one okay now you are going to bring your both feet together like this pull your spine up keep the back straight hold if you are not able to bring your heel too close you can move it slightly forward okay you should be comfortable try to keep your back straight now we are going to do the similar move as you inhale you're going to move your knees up as you exhale knees down okay it could happen that your knees are not coming this down it could be here it's okay wherever your knees are just start from there okay so as you inhale you will move your knees up as you exhale you are going to bring your knees down deep breathing slow breathing start with me now inhale up exhale down one inhale up exhale down two inhale up exhale down three inhale up exhale down four inhale up exhale down five inhale up exhale down six inhale up exhale down seven inhale up exhale down eight inhale up exhale down nine inhale up exhale down ten relax extend your legs forward this was the last move and with this we have completed our sequence if you are practicing these moves on a regular basis i can guarantee you you will see the difference in one month itself and if you keep on practicing you will uh, you'll you'll get better and better so yeah start as soon as you can if you're not able to do any practice leave it what is important is start do as much as you are comfortable and do not strain if there is pain while doing any movement skip this move stop this movement okay that is not meant for the body currently move on to the next movement so that is how you have to do uh, and yes we are going to conclude so we are going to conclude with om chanting chalo start with me now if you do not know how to chant om do refer my om chanting video start now three rounds of om chanting uh your palms together be thankful for the life you have got 
you will get better start rubbing now bring this energy to your eyes cover your eyelids and stay there for 3 2 1 slowly uncover and very gently open your eyes keep practicing these move and do let me know how you felt while practicing after practicing uh, these kriyas if you like this video do give me a thumbs up if you are new to the channel please subscribe to it and if you have any questions uh, if you have any feedback to share uh, please put it in the comment box and i will reply to them thank you so much for watching this video namaste